What's up, y'all? This is Melody Keisha back with another eating chat. I'm Mel. I'm Keisha. And this is a walk in a fat woman's shoes. Welcome back, MK Saints, visitors, passing through. Why are you so loud? Oh, I'm sorry. Wow, she just. My apologies. What's up? I'm like, what the? <clears throat> She's like, what's up, them kids? I'm like, what the? What I the forgot. Hell? I forgot. My apologies. So, tonight's in check, we have Jimmy Johns. Or if you from New Orleans, the Jimmy, Jimmy Jones. Jones. Right? So, we have Jimmy Jones tonight. Uh, Didn't feel like cooking. Mm -hmm. Got home late. Right, but, trying to be up. but we knew we was getting home late, so we got our Jimmy Jones. Right. Uh, we drinking on that good old H2O. Big girl ain't here, but she will do what? Nothing. Save you in a crisis. Yes, she will. Cause, yes, she will. cause a crisis. She'll cause How to get a big girl, a big soul, a big baby, or even a male baby will be in the description box below. See, so you going to click that link. You're going to get yourself one of yours. You're going to do it. You're going to do it. And yeah, it's going to be in the description box. I, I'm sorry, y'all. I hadn't been putting uh, putting it in the description box, the coldest water where you can get it. But I will put it in the description box tonight for you guys and everything. So, you know, y'all press my, you know, y'all click on that link. I got a new code. So, you know, click on that link and everything. You know, get yourself some. Oh, y'all, I do so. You ready? God is good. God is great. Thank you for the mail. About your seed. But that's your name. Let's prepare for the mail. Amen. 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 So what's going on with you guys tonight? Let us know what y'all eating and if y'all eating with us. Also let us know what's going on in y'all neck of the woods. How's your weather treating you? What y'all did today? Y'all not one of them nails. Them nails. Y'all know them nails. Which one is mine? Oh, no. That's that, not it. You know that's oh. yours. Oh. I got My shoulder two. is hurting bad. I might, wow. I, I most likely don't eat both of them, but well, I'm gonna eat both of them, just not on this video. Well, because this is I, don't, I don't eat nothing. I ain't eat nothing. Today. I uh, I'm hungry for one, and for two, uh, I be up, so I got me a late night snack. I have a I, unwitch, uh, a peppy unwitch. I have this right now that I'm opening. It's called the Vito. This is going to mess up. I'm not up. sure if I had the Vito before, but I'm trying to move through their menu and, you know, explore other things from Jimmy That's John's. That's what she sold me. You got to explore. But this is what I always get whenever I'm out and we don't, you know, when I'm uh, time to come and cook. Or whatever, or if we doing a video, if we have to do a video and I got to get something, this is going to be it. And because I don't you know, eat much, I just went and got the little John. I brought two little no, John. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just, I'm going to have my... Uh, I could have got the original, piece. but I was like... Mm. So, this does not come with mayonnaise. Yeah. <coughs> this does, but, and I asked for extra. If you want to know what's on it, give me a second. I'll tell you. Mm. It's called the Vito. Of course, it comes with lettuce and tomatoes. I didn't add anything to it because I want to experience up. it the way it is. Uh. You're gonna have to forgive him. He a little upset. So he he killing that bone. Okay, this comes with salami, capricola, provolone, onion, lettuce, tomatoes, all vinegar, and oregano basil. This pepper is a ham. It does not ham. have any mayonnaise. Ham provolone with lettuce. And extra mayonnaise. I should have told him to put the peppers on now. Mm. Mm 
Look at y'all. Very few New Orleans, New Orleans eat dry sandwiches. Mm -mm. I can't do the dry sandwich. Mm -mm. You ain't got that many. I can't. In one corner or both corners are dripping. Ain't no sound. My brother eat dry sandwiches. I don't get it. Uh. He don't even put mustard on it. He is a truly dry sandwich person. Mm. Now, if it is a uh, seafood or something, he might put ketchup on it. But, no, he's a dry sandwich dude. I don't mm -hmm. get it. More power to you. Right. I already knew I should have told her to put mayonnaise on this. But I wanted to try it like it comes. No, we need the mayo. Whenever I go to Jimmy Jones, it don't change. This is it. But she like, bench out, bench out, get her mine. I'm a bench out. So I got the what what was it? Mm. We went um not yesterday but the day before we went to Jimmy Jones and I got uh what was it? You saw that one yesterday? No, we mm -hmm. didn't go yesterday. It was something. It was another one. The what Billy Club. The Billy Club. That's mm -hmm. rose beef ham and provolone. I just added rose beef basically. But that one doesn't come with mayonnaise, right? Big it come with bacon on it. Mm -mm. That just come with, you know, provolone, ham, you know, ham, cheese, and roast beef and mustard. So I told him I said put some um, put extra mayonnaise on now, and um, it was good. But this is this is it. This is it. Man, I don't understand why they put the electric electrics in here when you know this electric right there, man. Come on, for real. Forgive me, my last day of well, it's okay. Physical therapy, really? Yeah, I'm sad for that. I am too. Cause my physical therapist this time she was really good. Like she really took the job because she wanted to help people. She ain't like the last one I had. He wasn't even making sure I was doing my finger exercises right. And that's literally the job. All we did when I went there. Damn, and look when you get a good one on your last day. Make you be like, man, I don't want to go. I want to keep coming. Mm -mm. I've been going to her for this finger. But I went to somebody for this finger, and he was not good. Like, God forgive me. And physical therapist, forgive me. 
But I think if you want dealing with the fingers and hands, you are the laziest mug in the world. You don't have to pick nobody up. You don't want to have to help them walk. You know, all you're literally doing is sitting there. Okay, now, these are your finger exercises. Let me show you how to do it. Now, you go ahead on and do it, and I'll watch you. <laughs> but, this time around, the physical therapist I had, she gave me tools. And my other physical therapist, my sessions with him lasted longer, and he ain't give me not one tool. Wow. Like, you gave me stuff that I could open jaws with and bottles. Way better than the one I brought from Timu. Um, she gave me stuff so that I could hold my pen and knife better. I probably need to go get a pool noodle and cut it down for my knives, though. Now that she done gave me the tool, I know what I got to do. They were pretty good. Mm -hmm. Don't judge me. But you remember back in the day when Came used to have those diners in them, mm -hmm. and he used to sell them sandwiches. Mm -hmm. That's what this remind me of. Boy, I miss those days. I came my family. Whatever, because. Sometimes, you know, depending on how my mama felt, but no, if we went to Kmart, we knew we was going to the restaurant, because my mama not cooking when we get home, even Walmart. We go to Walmart, we go into the snack bar. And because my mama was so tough, she wasn't going to cook. She would, uh, after we left, well, before we left, she would buy those sandwiches. Be like, I brought them sandwiches. Y'all better go home and cut them up and get happy. Oops. Only thing is, I ain't putting no mustard on this. I'm trying to remember. If they came with lettuce or some needle. I don't think they did. I think we added that when we got home. What, the came out sandwiches? Yes. yes. They did. Oh, they did? Mm-hmm. 
You want to know something? As much as we went to war work, I didn't know Wolver had a cafeteria. Really? Till one morning we was cutting through Wolver because it was cold. I said, oh, they got a cafeteria too. Which I should already knew that. Wait, Wolver? Of course they did. Because. The dino, um, they cafeteria is right there. The elevator is right there. We never went that far into the store with my mama or my grandma. Are you serious? She does. Man, man, my mama was always in Woolworth. Came up. Crouched. You were saying that? Maybe. But we was coming through Earth. Woolworths to go to McKenzie's. Mm -hmm. And then I found out Woolworths sell donuts. I went. Mm -hmm. Don't make no sense. I'm here already. That way I could go out this door and go right there to the bus stop. Girl, look, look, look. I I always frequent McKenzie growing up. Girl, when I found out they was selling chicken. McKenzie always did sell chicken. I did not know that. But you had to go to Gentilly to get it. Exactly. And when we went, you know, when we went, because we went shoe shopping, right? In Gentilly. <clears throat> when we went... To McKenzie, baby. And I found out they had chicken. My mom was like, she was like, you want some donuts, baby? I'm like, no, I want some chicken. Some chicken. She was like, you know, and I can remember it like it was yesterday. My mom was like, why did I, why I ain't no, you know, why I ain't think she wasn't going to want that chicken? Girl, yeah, yeah, I you know I was going to want that chicken, girl. You know me. I found out McKenzie sold chicken because my cousin. But, girl, you know me. I'm a confirmed chicken eat No, girl. But I love chicken. My mama used to get, you know, Katie's used to be right there. Mm -hmm. Was it Katie's? The health school. Yeah. Wait, okay. wait, wait, wait. In Gentilly? Yeah, Molar. right there. Who? Molar. Okay. It was Molar. I, I went to Molar with my mama one day and I saw it. And you want to know the crazy part about that? You know my mama from the Seven Ward. Mm -hmm. We always used to be in Gentilly, and I never. Y'all used paid. to go to the NB. We used to go to the McDonald's. We used to go to the K and B, mm -hmm. and I never knew fucking McKenzie sold chicken till mm -hmm. one day I went to Molas with my cousin. Girl, that was the hand I fan with your look. Guess what? I was getting out of school. You know, like when I was going to Colton. And shit, instead of just walking, because I could walk that way and walk home, right? It was a number like 10 blocks. It was 10 blocks. And I would walk it because, you know, I'd be, you know, with a whole lot of people and stuff. But shit, when I found out, I kept that friend the bus going all the way around, girl, go, by, but go get on and shit till the girl. Look, bitch. <laughs> Give me chicken. And my favorite was, you know, like... I, you know, I get the two-piece legs, but I get a five-piece chicken bag. I get two legs and five chicken bags. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. When I found out... I mean, I'm sorry, a leg and thigh and five chicken bags. Mm-hmm. Oh, yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. And the fuck up thing, I wasn't even fat. I wasn't mm -hmm. even fat. I wasn't even fat. That's fucked up. That's what that's how I like to do. It, it really is. When they changed them bus routes. That's what that's how I like to do. And the Legion Field used to turn around right there. Mm-hmm. Man, Cafe Du Mont, here I come. <laughs> Before I go to school, Cafe Shit, Dumont. when I was working out there in the French Quarter at the Bella Luna, I used to go to Cafe Du Mont and stuff. I used to go there, you know, because, shit, you know, that was like, I can get that, you know, had that for like lunch or whatever. Because if I didn't want to eat, you know, what they were making upstairs or whatever. Be. But most of the time, I was upstairs, you know, eating and everything. You know, because Chef used to be like, for you to be, for you to be the best at what you do, you have to taste everything that you make. You can't make something and not taste it. You can't make something and not taste it. 
He was German. That was, that, I mean, he, he, that was my dude. You know, like, you can't make something and you don't taste it. He used to always tell me that. Because, like, you know, I'm, I'm in the bakery. I'm in the bakery and stuff, you know, and everything. And we used to make these weird little braids and stuff like that. Man, I'm like, I don't want, I don't want that. <laughs> like, you have to taste it. You have to taste it to see what it tastes like to send out to the customers. Man, when I taste focaccia bread, baby, look. I was so German. I was. I would. I would literally get off work and go in, go in the uh, little shop and buy me a focaccia until I found out I didn't even have to do that. I could just, you know, I could just make my own focaccia bread and you know put it up, you know, until I got. So when I got off, I had bread. I but baby, when I found out, yeah. I was making focaccia pizzas, sandwiches, all kinds of shit. I, I was making all kinds of shit with that focaccia bread, for real. Lord, but, you, you know, want to know something, y'all? I never liked Tellman's mayonnaise. Right. Till I started. I think their mayonnaise is different than, than what they sell in the store. Right. Because what they sell in the store don't taste like that. Right. A lot of stuff that be in the packs. Just taste different. Just different. Like soy sauce. You ever taste the difference between the soy sauce you get in the bottle and the soy sauce you get in the pack? You ain't never taste the difference? And there's a difference. There That's is actually like a difference. We was having a debate about the ketchup. Because McDonald's, ain't they, don't they use Heinz? I believe so. If I, that Heinz you buy in the store don't taste like that. Matter of fact, we was riding down the street. Cuz had us some fresh fries. I went, oh, them fries smell so good. She was like, you want a few? I was like, yeah, I'll take a few. Now, normally when I got hot, fresh McDonald's fries, I put ketchup on them. But I was driving, so I couldn't do that this time. <laughs> yeah, you heard that motherfucker talking about because you know I was like, yeah, put them in my hand, and I had them. I was holding them while you was, you know, while you were driving, so you can have them like or whatever. She was like, oh, let me get it to you. I'm like, bitch. Oh, I'm that uh, I said, you know, she can't hold it, you know, so I'ma hold it for. Her. She was like, mm, and you burning your hand and all that shit. Yeah. You got it, cause you know I had it in my hand. I ain't have no. Uh, no napkin and nothing. I just had to mind she like you burning your hand and shit so she could get them little few fries. Let me get up to you. I'm like, girl, get out of my face, girl. <laughs> you know. But we was talking about that ketchup. Because then they saw I think they had burgers and I went, Oh my god, do you smell the ketchup? I was like If I gotta go somewhere and have a burger, if I have to if I just have to indulge in a burger with the bread, you know where I want to go. Other than that, I don't want a burger. No, bread. where do you want to go? Really? Steak okay. and shake. If I have to, look, I don't, look, I already don't buy burgers with buns. If I get a burger, if I get a burger out of trail somewhere, <clears throat> it has no bun. But if I have to get a burger with a bun, the only place that I want a burger with a bun it's steak and shake because they bread. Oh my god, it's just so good. It's so good. I don't know if it's the, I don't know if it's the burger with the bread or the bread with the burger. Look, I don't know. But all I do know, I don't know. Is but they garlic burgers butter are burger. Good. Oh my yeah. god, I don't know if they put the garlic butter on top of the bread or no. You know, and then in the it's burger, them point blank is their bread and their meat. Yo, because you know I used so to good. get them garlic sliders. Yeah, it is so so good. They don't and do then they don't even do the garlic no uh fry. They don't do the garlic fries no more. No, they don't. I don't I don't get the fries anyway. So you know I ain't gonna lie, I used to I used to love their garlic fries. But, but they, they fries no more, plain so or I ain't good? got no reason to get no damn fries. I just, just give me the bird. Just go on left there, give me the bird. I'm good. You are tripping their fries are good. Is it? Yes. Mm. You ain't hear me and Lazo? I heard y'all, but y'all like fries. No, I mean, I can take it and leave it with fries. Yeah, that's true. That's true. But I I can take it and leave it with fries. I'm not, you know, look, if a fry is hot and it got 
So hold on, let me get out. And I, I'm saying, when I say when I would buy fries, when I would do that and shit, it had to be hot with salt on it. With salt, you know. I ain't gonna lie. Some days McDonald's fries be just the shiznit. Then it be the not so shiznit. I'm like what the? What is that's this? That's they don't salt them. And I'm like, and that's what that's how you like fries. I can't stand fries like that. Because she'd be like, like when we would go, when we used to go to McDonald's and shit and all she'd be like, and give me a medium fry, no soap. I said, oh, damn. Now they going to fuck my fries up. Because you want them damn fries. You want fries with no soap. Now they going to fuck my fries up. And they did. They always did. No, they did. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. No, they did I can count on one hand and three fingers. How many times when we used to go to McDonald's, they wouldn't fuck my shit up? One hand, one hand, three fingers. That's probably how many times we went. Probably. Probably. Uh, we ain't no McDonald's fans like fuck that. No. Fuck no. I'm not saying we don't eat McDonald's, but. Yeah. Sure. I told, I told uh, Dwayne, I say like. He's like, Mama, you want something from McDonald's? I said, give me a double quarter pounder. Give me two double quarter pounder patties and stuff. Somewhere along the line, he did not understand the assignment. Because he was going to come bring me two double cheeseburgers with debris. When that was? The other night, I'm like, who the fuck going to eat that? He's like, but that's what you said. I said, no, I told you two double quarter pounder patties with no bread. You brought me two double cheeseburgers. Why with did the you bread just say a bread. double quarter pounder with no bread? I wasn't thinking about that. I just told him two double quarter pounder patties. Patties. You, Come on, now, he ain't dumb. You making shit harder than it got to oh, be. Why you just can't say, give me a double quarter pounder with no bread? You didn't want the onions, ketchup, or none of that either? Why didn't you just say, give you a double quarter pounder? Yeah, I know, man. No bread. Like that, but I, I, and dry. I thought he could have. I thought he would understand. A double selling. quarter pounder. I tell him to no Curtis and Terrell when I tell him, look. Look. Double quarter pounder, plain, no bun. Simple as that. You got to learn their lingual. You got to learn their language. I tell Curtis and Terrell, a patty melt, no That's bun. That's not Curtis or a Terrell. A patty melt, just the patties, no bun. Do they so no onions? No, but I no always cheese. get fucking onions. No cheese. No, every now and again I get the cheese. No but sauce. No, no sauce. No sauce. Just a patty milk. Just a patty milk. No bread. Just patty milk bread. Patty milk patties. That's it. That's it. And they understand that shit. Why he can't? You know, and then I ain't gonna lie. One then, day, one day he understood the assignment and brought me a uh, double quarter pounder patties. But you know what? I had told him I said, "Give me, t- give me a quarter pounder with cheese, a double quarter pounder with cheese." That's when I got the two patties. That was when I got the two patties. I'm like, he still didn't understand the assignment. I say, son, are you in there? Are you in there? He was like, what you mean? I said, you in there? I said, because I remember. Because I told him that before. Like, I told him that like a month ago before. Same damn thing. Two double quarter pounder patties. Before. And got uh, two double cheeseburgers. Same thing. And I'm like, are you in there? You know, like, is you in there? No. You know, is you? That's because you don't remember you was like, oh, sometimes I need smaller meat. And I told you just get the double cheeseburger, no bread. Yeah. Same thing, same yeah. thing. I ain't had a quarter pounder in a minute. All right. He about to go to work overnight though, so I ain't gonna get him. He was like, night. So mama, there you go. I'm like, what the fuck you think we eat that? He says, so you're not gonna eat them like the hell now. That motherfucker ate the rest of my nuggets. <laughs> what? What? 
I ain't seen him since I, I told him to put him down. <laughs> wow. No, no. Ain't that a But I already knew that, dude. No problem. I didn't think he was going to be the one to eat him, dude. Why not? Because he came here, he had all kind of shit. Talking about, look at what I got there. Look at that, look at that. <laughs> and he had, uh, he had burrito tacos and quesadillas. When he had all that? The day he brought me the nuggets. Where was it? You was in the room. The day before yesterday. And when he, by the time he finally got here, I ate like four or five nuggets. And I was going to put the rest in the refrigerator, but I was like, no, here, just go ahead and put that down. I know one of y'all going to eat it if I mm. leave it in there, but go ahead. On. I didn't expect them to jump on it like that, but they did. Then he going to tell me something, buy him something, sell me. I've been out the store for a whole hour. What he talking about, never mind, I don't want it. Hey, bitch, you going to run me my money. Right, you going you gonna to run that. I don't want to have to choke you. I'm not going to eat it. You going to run that because salmon ain't cheap. It was on sale, you know, though. I was looking for uh, oxtail. It was nine ninety nine a pound. I, I want some oxtails, oxtails I too. Want I want to get some. Well, Monday when we go to the store. Yeah. Because we supposed to get rain all weekend. I know. And ain't nobody traveling in that rain. Not at all. Not at all. That's why anything we we got to get, we better get it between now, which is what, Wednesday? And early Friday. Friday morning. Because guess what? Well, I don't know what time it's supposed to start raining. But guess what? When it start raining... I plan on being in the house. In my house. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No. And y'all, with that being said, what, you looking up hey. something? Do it look like it? Yes. Sorry, wow. I hate this shit. Damn. Give me a second. If you want to. Mm, 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 mm. Wow. Average weather, 60 degrees. What it was today, 71. <laughs> wow. And last year it was 56. Mm. Mm. Uh, Chill out, I'm looking. Because I'm about to say, you told me give you a second for that? Friday. No, I won't do that. Well, Thursday we ain't doing nothing. Let's go back to Friday. You ain't doing nothing. I'm going to Walmart. You going to Walmart tomorrow? Yup. Well, more power to you. I'll be laying to be. I'm 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 looking for pigtails. I'm looking for pigtails or pig feet. Well, they said Friday there's only twenty five percent. I want to probability of participation. Like I might eat seafood. Y'all, if I do Did seafood you hear me? tomorrow, what? They say Friday there's 25% chance of precipitation. Okay. But I don't like going to this one. I'm sorry. I need the weather channel for my weather. If I do seafood, I am frying me some seafood. I'm going to fry me some seafood. Wow. Yes. I went to Kroger. I got some. Wow. I got Look. some lobster tails. I had already had lobster tails. It's supposed to rain a whole week long. Look, that's Friday. All the way to next Friday. Wow. I had got some lobster tails. And like I was saying before, I had already bought some lobster tails. But I just bought a few. Um, I just bought a couple of them today because I wanted some fresh ones. Because tomorrow, hey, we can I ain't going to have the defrost oh. or whatever. So, um, tomorrow, you like I'm being probably going to have seafood. Uh, late at night? Oh, uh, so, yeah. You a late at nighter? What? You a late, late at nighter? Yeah, you already know. I say that because on Friday from 3, it's only supposed to be 40%. I'm about that. Right. I'm about that. We uh, go, we go to the store. Hmm? We go to the store. I, I don't know. I don't know if I want to. I don't really need to buy anything just for the mere fact that 
I have a tri-tip, two chuck roast shrimp out the wazoo. Look, from three and other seafood in there already. I don't really need nine. to really go. No, three to anything. eleven. So I don't know. I'm I may go to Walmart, like I may not, you know. So. Oh, it won't be windy. My shoulder is. Any right, of y'all then. suffer with clicking of the shoulder, like your shoulder just feel like it be put clicking some avocado spray up. on it. Not the grease. Are you joking? About what? Avocado spray on my shoulder. Not the vegetable spray. Not the avocado spray. Oh. Like you cook with. You know, you know I'm a little slow on the uptake. I be spraying. I be spraying. I be like, be like, what the fuck you doing? I'm like, you said put avocado spray on my shoulder. I know you I'm just saying. Spray. You know, it ain't y'all feel like the clicking or whatever. To where you have to hold your arm down so it'll stop clicking and stuff. And. You know, it, it's, I don't know. It just feel like I can raise my arm, but I have to, like, assist it and stuff. Which, you know, that, 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 that that's a lot. That, that work on my nerve. You know, but anyway, y'all, with that being said, we hope y'all enjoyed this video and conversation. Until next time, we hope y'all enjoyed this video. We love y'all. Y'all take care. Be blessed. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. Thank you for coming and watching and rocking with us. And until next time, we're going to plant you down and dig you later. Because I know y'all can pick up what we are putting on. You hear me? Peace. Peace, y'all.